my name is JP. I'm Canadian brand manager for Swims, and you're watching Trend Hunter TV. Just tell me a bit about the um, fall and winter uh, collection for Swims. What was the inspiration behind it? Basically, the collection's inspiration is the classic, which is an overshoe, mm -hmm. and they've integrated that idea to shoes and footwear. So what they've done is created the Harry collection. The Harry collection is composed of three styles. You have the boot, a zip-up, and a derby. Um, each shoe comes with a full rubber belt around the sole of the shoe, so it c protects the shoes against water damage, and it makes it waterproof at the bottom. Also, you have a water-resistant canvas, which is used onto the top part of the shoe. Catherine Muter designed uh, the Swims collection for Fall Winter 13, the Harry collection, and basically, the inspiration of the collection comes from her background, Armani, and mixing in the swim's DNA, so incorporating water and playfulness to the design of the shoes. What does swim do to stay relevant and on the cutting edge? All right, well, one of the first things is they're actually reinventing classic. This is what they've done for, uh, since the start. Uh, the first product that they've done was the swim's overshoe. So basically what they've done is just take that classic uh, galosh and make it into a swims product. So they've redefined the lines, uh, redefined the functional aspects of that uh, product, um, including flocking on the inside. So it makes it so much easier for you to put the, uh, the galoshes on and off of your shoes. How does swims balance um, style and comfort so seamlessly? Well, one of the first things is if we look at the Sport Loafer, which is a new introduction for Fall Winter 13, uh, we have introduced an EVA sole, which is very soft and comfortable and which is easily washable as well. If we look at the Harry collection, uh, the, uh, the outsole is made of natural rubber, which is naturally soft and also adds to comfort of the shoe. What trends in footwear do you see um, taking off this year? Well, actually, there, one of the trends would be um, we're looking at the dapper gentleman. So we have the classic overshoes from Swims. And I think this is something that's even more present than it was, as I see more leather shoes being, um, being present on the market. There is truly a need for people to protect their shoes using overshoes. So this is a trend, and actually it has become an icon of fashion. Uh, we have seen the classic overshoes from swim um, in, uh, in fashion shows, namely from AG and Sam in London. So there's a strong presence there. And I've seen a lot of people actually wear these overshoes over their sneakers. So there's a mix and combination of trends here happening. Uh, Fantastic Man, for instance, in the in publication out of the UK, featured the Swim's classic overshoe over a pair of New Balance sneakers, which wouldn't sound too intuitive, but it all works in the end.